Welcome, in this video I'll show you how to transfer Okta Verify from one phone to another. As you can see here, on my Android phone, I do have Okta Verify. I don't know if you can see it. This one, I'm just going to open it up just for you to see. Like so. Now, I'm going to go ahead and transfer this uh, Okta Verify to this iPhone. Okay? Now, first up, go ahead and open up your Okta account. Okay? Right here, log into your Okta account on your browser. Any browser, it could be your phone or your computer. Okay? Now, once you're in here, go to the top right and tap on your profile. Now, go ahead over to settings. Okay? Now, in here, as you can see, we have a security methods. Now, what we'll do here, we have two options. Okay? You can just go ahead and straight up set up another, or you can go ahead and remove this one and then add in a new Okta Verify. Okay? Now, let's say, for example, I'm just going to go ahead and set up another right here. And, of course, it's going to need the code from our Okta Verify app. In my case, I do have it on my Android phone. So, I'm going to go ahead and put that code in here and then just hit on Verify. Password. Then, click on Setup, like so. Now, what we'll do here is just go ahead and open up the phone or new phone, which, in my case, I do have in uh, Apple device in here. Okay. So I'm going to grab my Apple device. Now I'm going to go ahead and open up uh, App Store right here. And then I'm going to go ahead and find Okta. Okay. Let's just make sure to uh, download it and, and then just wait for the process to finish. As you can see here, the process is done. It's now installed. So I'm going to go ahead and tap on open. Now, in here, I'm just going to go ahead and uh, tap on Add Account from another device. Okay, for example, I'm going to hit on Continue right here. Allow. Now we have the option to scan a QR code. Okay, just tap on Allow. Now our phone's camera is open. So let's just go ahead and scan the QR, like so. And then once done, if you want to, you can go ahead and allow push notifications. If not, just hit on Skip. Face ID right here, enable it if you want to, and it says here, account to add it. Just hit on done, and here we have the Okta Verify app and the code, right? That is it. And as you can see here on our computer, our iPhone and the Android phone is active. Now you can go ahead and remove the Android phone right here if you want to, all right? That is it. That's how you transfer your auto verify from one phone to another. Well, I hope this video helps and I'll see you in the next one.